So this part of the world just won't see any more plants. Fair enough. Ecological Consortium? I figured we might have saw more of those bat things. But that doesn't seem to be happening either. I'm so close. I'm at 184 of 185 carrying capacity. You to flaunt your flying. Plus side, by the time we get back to base, I will have leveled up my weightlifting. So we're going to be able to certify that. Get me an extra 50 pounds. I'm oh, sorry, 50 kilograms. Which is more like 110. Or, yeah, 110 pounds. Like it doesn't say fauna or flora complete, but we're not seeing a lot of the other stuff at all. to just leave them there. These things can't fight back at all against those coral bug things. How the coral bug things are in such big numbers and those are like constantly dead makes no sense. This biome is completely ecologically unbalanced.
get more breath. Maybe we can take one of those drinks to help. Actions use 20% less O2 for three minutes. There we go. Can you have multiple things going? Like if I also drank or ate, like increased energy. Resources way less, so I can't swap that off because I have a ton of resources. I wonder. Sidonia is an. I'd be happy to. All right, if I take all her resources and I give her that other stuff I got, like extra guns. I forgot to mark that as my new compass. Twenty percent more capacity for oxygen. Veterans Cavalry Space Trucker space helmet it's got increase on everything except for it doesn't have chameleon or it doesn't have the resources way last thing okay we'll give her that then that'll be my normal helmet and we'll do this while we're mining in that i guess I'm so close to being underweight. both underway. Talk to you so. later. completed already. Oh, must have completed on the way out. Oh. It doesn't have its own... Rank 4 doesn't have a certification? That's silly. There should still be a certification for Rank 4.
happens and it's like, okay, you're rank four, but now you're rank four certified. Like that little tier extra, a little tip of the hat, you know? other two traits. Will I be able to find them anywhere or only in certain biomes? Her name has a boost. There should be a way of tracking down traits from space. Orion Tower. Is that where my parents live? Sergeant Yumi was looking for you. Apparently, he's got some work. How did you get ahead of us? No, I'm not feeling that bad. So I got some last spaceship, but Does then I hurt? realized. You detect uncommon inorganic resources on planet and moon surfaces and more information about ships in space. You can detect rare fun stuff. Exotic fun stuff. Unique fun stuff. Is that the one? Not this one, the below this one? That's, is it? Spend seven points to be at you can scan moons from your current planet. You have a 10% chance to discover a trait. Ah, and then 20, 30, only up to a 50% chance to discover a trait. That doesn't seem that good a chance. Might grab a I Dr. Pepper early. I thought I'm I got stuck. decent sleep. But... Only place close enough to land. Wait. You're not suggesting. Ptolemy 2. Terramorph Heaven. So, I sat down, grab the highest caliber weapon I've got, and start walking. Boom. If that had actually happened, you wouldn't be standing here. No lie. Hell, you're welcome to go ask around the marine outpost I stumbled into. You're the only reason I'm still breathing. I <laughs> set foot on that death trap. I think I'll just take your word for it. But they wouldn't even let me stay in the space, so I doubt he could land. Because they're like, if you don't leave and you try to approach the planet, we're going to go hostile.
Oh, right, we were going to go get that tree branch, like the tree thing sorted out. I almost forgot about that. Maybe I don't want to go that way. <laughs> sure. Tell you, what, you let me know. I'm going to take a quick break. I'm going to go grab something for the pain. Have a quick bathroom break and then be right back with uh, Dr. Pepper so that hopefully I'll stop yawning a little bit. And we'll continue. Hey. We're 69% done the survey of the planet. Um, since we landed on that number, I might just have to leave it there. Anyways, be right back. All right, we're back. And I got a kitty that's come, decided to come join me. Apparently the scammer has a branch. What do you mean the scammer? Like the the guy that made us steal the data? carry 235 now. Might not be a matter of noticing him, but just maybe I haven't encountered him yet. I've never been to a killer city. Only city I've been into is New Atlantis. You've been busy, I hear. Clearing out bad guys. <laughs> Here. I've heard you some hostile this. camps were wiped off You'll the map. You'll be scanned by. as you enter the city. Were, Please really keep moving. Out there. Oh, it's on the tip of my tongue. They're giving me money for just running by them. Before we leave for that, are you this your outpost to sleep? Found a note about a secret outpost on a dead spacer. Might be worth a read. Search for evidence. That's for the going undercover. Deep cover, right? Enjoy this. We'll go do that in a second. Roost. Whoa, that's way out there. I don't like the way they limit how you can view the map. All right, doesn't look like we have anything pressing on the planet except for to go join the UC core. So what I think I'm going to do is Hello. get all the resources Hi. off of our people. Carrying objects is one of my simplest. Oh, excuse me. He's the, he's got nothing on him. Okay. I will await your next order here. He follows me around. Okay. We're going to go to the trade place to sell all the crap we have. There should be like a kiosk right up here where you can sell your stuff. 
That way you don't have to go down to the well. Is there, is there one that I just not noticed? A service technician. On the edge of the landing platform? This thing? Oh, yeah, it does see trade authority. Look at that. Need some work done? I I know the guy mentioned it yesterday. I think Schmitty did. And I looked and I didn't notice. I just didn't notice that. How I didn't notice the, the neon green yellow thing is beyond me. No, actually, wait. Before we do that, we need to. Wonder where this one is. How's it going, Schmidt? I'm doing pretty good. Dropping off a few. That's okay. I don't got stolen or illegal stuff right now. Oh, armor piercing rounds. Six extra DPS, but the suppression thing can help us with our sneaking up and taking people out. Yeah. It I think people wanted it to be seamless for everything. No menus. This game is menus galore but that doesn't take away from the fact that it's a lot of fun also a lot of people don't pay enough attention on how you actually play the game so they think they see things where, like you can only go so far in a square at, like what per landing that they don't realize that you don't have to land where it tells you is a point of interest but you can land anywhere you want on the planet so you can fully explore planets. I, I was even under that mis- Like, I fell under that at first when I was hearing people complain about that. They're like, look, you land. It's like, these are the places you can land. And the person in the video showed it. And he's like, then you land and you can go here. But it's like, you go so far, then it stops you. That's bullshit. They were told we could explore the planet. And like, he went on a whole rant. Admittedly, when I was watching that, I didn't see the thing that says, when you're looking at the planet, we can land anywhere. Right? Like, I think the biggest problem is people not paying attention to what the game actually lets you do. So they think the game's limiting them, and it's really not. I guess we'll get. Should we get rid of her Grendel, too? Like, right now, she's got the Marine. Anti ballistic. Mm. Do we lower her physical so that she can get 15% less damage from physical range? Yeah, that's the other thing. A lot of people aren't used to being able to just, like, the whole explore out your own thing. They kind of are used to being breadcrumbed into all the experiences a game has to offer. And this game is like, go find it. I like the exploring, though, so that works for me. Why I streamed it 14 hours yesterday. I couldn't put it down. There's a mod that will take that zone limitation and it streams in things so that you can walk as far as you want on a planet from any one landing. But do you really want to be able to walk an entire fucking planet and then have to walk all the way back to your damn spaceship because you're overweight and you can't fast travel? It's P 
people start make, like wildly dreaming about what they're told on a game rather than paying attention to how games actually work. MD two fifty six sixty four. I think that's a good suit. What we could give her this one. It's almost as valuable as this one. Except for it's just natural defense. It doesn't have to worry about the 15% reduced physical. Here, okay. You guys know the game better than me. Is it better to go a high physical resistance or 15% less damage because this one has an 85 but you take full damage and this one is 53 but you take 15 percent less all right um I'm going to switch her. Whoop, shit. I'm going to switch her over to that. Oh, not the frontier. Sarah. Sarah's going to use the new backpack here. That way she gets that 15% damage anyway. Now she's 15% damage from all human attacks. Get for blend or a chameleon pirate assault helmet gives her chameleon and similar defense. Well, actually, this one's better across the board, but chameleon. I'll keep both suits for now. It's just seven pounds. And now that I have that full, full weightlifting bonus, weight's not a big deal for us. Time to go. Probably be selling it in a second anyway, but. Anything I can help you with? Here we go. So we're selling to the vendor. I'm going to make sure we have both of these. I think we do. Well, I know we have a king of hearts. I think we have all the aces. Just sell it. All right. Now our notes. Check this out. Chala survey data. Etheria survey data. Mineral survey plutonium. When did I get? Oh, that's the thing I found. Okay. Oh, all of this survey data. Ptolemy survey data was worth a lot. Minus 15% damage from enemies. Just more on. Okay. Uh... 
I'm tempted to keep the UC Marine suit for other people, but... Oh, they're out of money. Well, that was disappointing. Like, it's nice that there's money there so I can go and sell to both, but... You will be scanned as you enter the city. That's a lot of resources. <laughs> oh, the clothing store, maybe. I was thinking this but we could tell to this guy or just go to the trade authority. I'm telling you, Bianchi, something's wrong with the boots you sold me. I wear them to the metro. Suddenly, the shuttle runs late. I buy a cup of coffee and the barista screws up my order. It's like I'm walking under ladders with a broken mirror in my pocket. And the only time it happens is when I'm wearing your boots. So? What do you want me to do about it? I want a damn refund. What? Fine, this hair fine. looks wrong. I'll take the boots back. Just don't tell anyone you bought them from here. You ask me, the real New Atlantis is down here. All that stuff tops. All this stuff is legit. Promise. Absolutely. All right. Having. He's already out of credits? Absolutely. He's lucky I need to buy ammo. Where was that 50 cal ammo we had? There we go. What shotgun shells do my, uh, my one gun? I'll have to double check. Uh, the lawgiver, that's 5.5. I got that. All right, it requires. Am I just blind? I'm not seeing it. Aceless shell. Okay. Is that it? The 11 mil? No, that's not the right one. Does he not have? Oh, way down here. Aha. A light particle fuse. Hmm. <laughs> we got 69 of the 43. Ah, <sighs> uh, that's funny. Okay. Um. Double check. Well, he's got he's got a marine pack, power pack, and a skip pack. What's the difference between a boost and a skip? No, I th maybe. <laughs> but isn't the the fifty cal ammo for my lawgiver? 0.50 cal. Oh, no, you're right. That's the wrong 50 cal. Is he not? He doesn't have the ammo for my, my lawgiver? Well, shit. I saw the point five and I didn't pay enough attention. That's on me. Yeah, you're right. I got them. 
I'm guessing that's like military array or something. I don't know what the 0.5 MI array means. Oh well. Sell from the frontier. Why did it just sell like three things? Of course it can't be in the order you accidentally sold things. That's what I'm afraid. I don't know if it matters, but it sold one of those books that give you the permanent upgrade. Probably doesn't matter, but might as well make a collection out of them. That's what I like to do. I like to have collections in games like this. Hat. The fact that it's like a darker purple goes with my hair a little bit. Uh, get rid of that. All right, helmet. and corrosive resistance but the stats aren't that great all right charger suit Ooh, check out that suit stats aren't that bad that's only a thousand oh well The Berserker Suppressed Calibrated Grendel's 85 DPS. Yeah, see, there we have a revolver, sort of. At least it, it's, it rings a revolver to me because of that one part. I did not mean to get rid of my cutter. I need to send that back to me. There we go. Yeah, give me one second. 
did not mean to sell whatever I just sold. Do we want an extra naval cutlass for anybody? Nah. Ooh, that one's got a long barrel, medium scope suppressor, and is semi-automatic. Thirty percent more damage versus aliens. I don't know. I don't know what you're trying to get. I'm sure once I see it, I'll be like, oh, oh yeah, okay, I get it. <laughs> but until then, I don't know. Oh, he's out of money. Hey, take it easy. This is this should teach him to run out of money. That's mine. Give it back. I think he saw me somehow. How does that make sense? I'm invisible. I guess he gave me time to get it back. I'm sorry, at that point, it, there should be a button where it can be like pressed to give it back, like press button to give it back type thing. Probably because I don't actually have stealth. But I'm literally invisible and crouching. Like, come on. It was worth a try. Oh, wait. No, so if I go the right way. Let me know if I can help you. Kill for a cup of coffee right about now. It's cliche. Even in the well, of course, the trade of course. authority can. Fifty calorie caseless. Is that what I needed? Didn't have very many of it. Faceless shoddy. And the three kilovolt for my laser. There we go. Got crap weapons. Technophiles calibrated Rendell. Ooh, it's tactical grip, laser sight, short scope, compensated, armor piercing. Except for it's still hot rate of fire. I want it to be semi-automatic. Like, less rate of fire, more kick. Although, I guess maybe that's a good thing about it. It's fast fire than it was on. <laughs> you think it's also raw? Uh, you're probably right. But eventually, I'll have ammo. Like, ammo doesn't weigh you down, so... Nope, that was right. 50 caliber caseless. 28 rounds, we're good. Is there any point in not just selling everything?
chicken tikka manada or whatever. That's actually kind of tempting, that using 20% less oxygen for things. Does it count running as well? Or is it only, like, specific actions? Ooh, the, these... Dark brew? Do these make you drunk? It doesn't mention anything about drunk. Oh, well, we'll sell it either way. We got 15 ship parts. If we go back, we can find grandma. We might be able to help, or not grandma, uh, the magic school bus. If we find the magic school bus, we should be able to help. I'm not doing the drugs. Vital hyper catalyst vital fluid. Needed the I'm not getting rid of nickel. We're always short of nickel. Like I know we're not doing a lot with making stuff yet. But we'll be doing that eventually, so I don't want to, like, go overboard selling this, even though most of it's not worth a lot. The value per the stack. Yeah. The Caliumite is worth the most. The conductors, like, still only a few hundred. Like selling it all would probably only make us only one or like maybe two thousand. Maybe we have one hundred and fifty-six mass in aid. Oh, the the ship parts, right? Ship parts take up way too much mass for their own good. Food seems to be balanced for one hundred max health. Wouldn't surprise me. Continues to flourish. Pleasure dealing with you. Makes you sick. That's part of my problem with the game. Like everything seems to be super stat limited to game of like to overly gamify things. Like how much of the how limited the speed goes and I think a lot of people are hoping that this game would be more of a simulation and less of a game. And it's more of a game than a simulation. Which is... Like, if you want a simulation, go play uh, Star Citizen. 
which I tried once during an open I think weekend. I could live on coffee if I had to. It was my old computer, mind you, but even with my 3060 at the time, I still I got like five. I was getting like five frames per second. I wasn't even on high wasn't settings or anything. Guy, it's just uh, like basic settings. Taking a look at your file. Exactly X4. There you go. Good one. I meant with like. Yeah, I guess it's, it is that kind of same, very similar experience. So. Yeah, go play X4. Hello, Captain. X4 still gamifies a lot, especially with the movement and stuff. But X4 is really good at the other, like the building Hi, and Captain. the materials and that. Where are we headed next? All right, we're gonna go blow up a fighter, and then we're gonna probably go to. Where do you guys want me to go? Do you want me to go undercover or explore stuff with the uh, constellation? Thrust is firing. Now that we've upgraded the ship, so we've got a thousand storage, and we, we shoot, so we punch so much harder than we used to. Achieving orbit now. Mantis quest is what's on. <laughs> Read the secret outpost slate. Okay. Oh, that reminds me. Before I forget, gotta rebind the cutter. Actually, you know what? I'm not going to bind the cutter. cutter. Well, I will. But that way, I'll just have the cutter on me for when we need it. Or when I scan. Also, as much as I love that gun, I think I'm going to go... Oh, I still got to upgrade my Equinox. I think the mouse, I think this is my currently my favorite gun. It needs more upgrading, but it's doing really good for me. All right, so notes. Which note am I supposed to be reading? Is a spacer note, right? Secret outpost. Loyal to your crew, I get it. But screw that, bag. Borrow, steal, kill to get to Denoblia, Den Denobula 1B. There's a secret outpost we're trying to crack. Once in a lifetime opportunity. You'll regret it for the rest of your life if you don't go to Denoblia 1B. So get your ass over there. We're going to go to Fox's home world. We're going to Denobula. Uh, I know I mispronounced that, but that's where we're going. Back in the cave. I hate my life. Going in here for some dumb salvage was a horrible idea. And these cre you and these things creep me the hell out. There's so much more than we can carry out here out there. Why do we need to send anyone in here? So my bright idea was to draw straws. I figured the odds of me pulling the short straw would be pretty slim. Guess not. Because they rigged it. I'm pretty sure I'm bleeding internally and I can't really move, so there's no way I'm getting out of here on my own. I just hope those jerks out there remember that I'm in here before leaving. Which is interesting, because they make it seem like he was salvaging the mech graveyard, but there was no real salvage in the mech graveyard. A uh, hyperspectral survey of Chthonia indicates a high probability of a significant deposit of plutonium near the surface. Recommended follow-up by a field survey team. We got that from a satellite. Good job with the straws. Totally screwed that guy over. <laughs> well, there's Daryl. We've told you a million times it's none of our business what the client's doing with their stuff. Aaron Slate. Oh, John's such a kiss-ass. All right, that was all from that last place we went to. Oh, here's the one I was looking for. The Ecliptic Communicator. Yeah, I communicate all Ecliptic personnel. Our recent meetings with representatives of both the Free Star Collective and United Colonies have confirmed what we assumed. Any facilities abandoned during the Colony War are considered fair game. Unowned and unattached. The spoils of war. That means they don't belong to us. So if you locate one of these bases, labs, or outposts, you have full authority to appropriate any equipment on behalf of Ecliptic. And 
That's not quite true, Ecliptic. If they're squatters, that means the squatters got the rights. It's now theirs. But if it's unoccupied, it's all yours. Attention, Ecliptic personnel. We've received viable intel on the location of another colony war era facility, specifically a research lab. It's somewhere in the Narian system, possibly already occupied by pirates of the Crimson Fleet. As has already been communicated by Commander Creek, you have full authorization to claim the facility for Ecliptic and appropriate anything deemed viable for our combat operations. If the base is, in fact, under the control of the Crimson Fleet or anyone else, Command grants full authorization to eliminate that threat using any means necessary. Captain Bales out. Okay. Attack. Yeah, they, they just happened. We came here and all these people were dead as we arrived. We, I, it's almost like bullets showed up just as we stepped on the base. Monahan, it's time. Hendrick and I are finally going to make a run for it. This is probably your chance to get out of there. You should really rethink this and join us. It's happening tonight. You know where. Oh, excuse me. I didn't want to. Didn't want to take it. I wanted to read it. All right. I think we already read these two. Cause that's the, we, hey, we have an ectic, an extra two. And those. Oh, I forgot to sell a book. Next time. <laughs>